Hey, it's Udi, and today I want to do something different. We have FL Studio. So usually I'm with Cubase and uh, I, I really love Cubase, but I wanted to see what FL Studio is all about. So while exploring that, I got an email from FL Studio guys that they've added a video generator wizard. So I didn't know that uh, they, they had that option in FL Studio to begin with and now they all also have a wizard. So I'm going to show you that. It's going to be real simple stuff but if you're new to FL Studio that might be you know interesting for you. So let me show you what we've got. So I, I'm going to drag and drop uh, one of my tracks here. This one. And this is how it sounds. Next, I'm going to uh, just place the Z Game Editor Visualizer on the master. So if you don't know how to find that, that's in the plugins here in the... I mean, if you're used to this view, you're going to the plugins and here we have visual and under visual we have the Z Game Editor. I'm gonna just drag and drop that on my master. So this is what we've got. That's the, the video generator. And um, what I'll do is just uh, um, gonna play the song first. And as we go, I'm just gonna do this. I'm gonna click the wizard. And there you go. You can just punch in the name of the, the name of the track. And let me just put my headphones aside. And we have the author, that's me. Woody. And you can just uh, write whatever you want here, and and then what you you can do here is let's let's maximize that. You can see that we have lots of options here, so um, let's just play with that. How cool is that, right? I mean, as easy as that, and I can take this as you know as it is but you can also start and tweak things so uh, we can just browse through and change the background here or you can you know find something from from this view here next we have some other uh, you know some other stuff that you can do for example you can change the process here so uh, let's just select something else and see what it does just flick through this next we can uh, we can change the foreground so the foreground uh, is is really the the spectrum analyzer kind of thing here so let's uh, let's see how that works you see here that that circle And you can change the placement here. You can see that I, I can put it here with this control. And again, you can place this here. And you can also change the, the fonts. So I, I can change how that font looks like. And again, I can move this somewhere else. And we can just select anything again, just I'm I'm really really happy with this because th this really I mean it allows me to take my tracks and put them in YouTube and and that's pretty cool. So let let's let's continue from here. I'll just select something. For example, this preset here. I'm I'm not going to change anything right now. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to continue to to render. So as you can see here, um, I can just select the destination here, the presets. We have different options here for example YouTube HD and it's already here and that's it they, they ask you to uh, to include this text here but uh, now from here you what you can do is click click OK and then you can start the rendering and you'll get the file and I'll show you where it lands um, you can change the destination and, and you can do a bunch of stuff here. For example, you can leave uh, some reminder, cut reminder, uh, reminder, sorry. And then you can select the, the audio settings here and resampling and whatnot. So I'm, I'm going to leave that for you to, to check. Next, um, now, if I'll click start, 
then we'll just render the, the, the file here, that's fine. But uh, I just want to show you something else. So I'm going to click here. And here you see the, 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 the Z game editor user interface uh, without the wizard. And you can see here that you have a progress bar here, a slider, sorry. And there's a lot of options. So you, you can play with that as well. So for example, I can change the, the image here. So uh, um, for example, this, or I don't know, I'm just going through some stuff here. So you can do this manually. So you can create your own custom uh, video without really, um, you know, the, using the wizard. That's perfectly fine. And you can change the positioning and you can do a lot of, you know, things here. You can see the spinning here. And then we can change stuff here on the foreground, for example. So that, that's the foreground. Um, again, changing all these uh, little things here will, will make uh, you know will make a difference and you can change the positioning here and you can change the image so you might want to maybe explore that as well so the wizard is pretty useful if you just want to get started you want something real quick but then you can tweak it here even further and uh, I, I mean for me this is really a uh, you know going to be a lot of fun just creating your own videos so this is it I, I'm just gonna go back to the wizard now and I'm gonna show you how I'm rendering so I, I'm, I'm just selecting whatever preset here we we went through all these options and of course you uh, one last thing here you can randomize everything and just click this and yeah let's let's go with this so I'm gonna do this right now the, the, this project is not named really so wh when i'm going to to render this you, you see that there's i mean that's the path here so i can i can uh, just select um something else k2 let's call it k2 demo and that's it i'm gonna click okay and start so right now it's rendering and we're done. So uh, now we have the, the video ready and we can go uh, to the FL Studio um, folder and see where is our, um, where is the video file. And there you go. So we have FL Studio and project that's the default place and we have our uh, video here that's the the video and i can double click here and there you go you don't hear it because i need to set the the audio to route but never mind that's uh that's the idea here so uh, there you go very very cool the the new zgame editor visualizer wizard and let me offer you this so uh, if you want me to create a video for you let's do it so uh, put a comment and uh, maybe um, you know you can share soundcloud or whatever where you have your uh, your track and i'll choose uh, you know i'll see if uh, it, it, it's something uh, you know I, I can relate to and i'll create a video for you how about that so let me know in the comments and that's it for now so if you're um you know, if you if you want this, uh, you know, kind of thing, uh, yeah, let's uh, let's try and see how it goes. Um, you know, maybe we can. Uh, you know, if you let me, I'll upload the video to my channel. If it's good music, why not? Or you can, of course, uh, use it um, by yourself, definitely. Uh, yeah, and that's it. So, um, if uh, if you're not subscribed to my channel and you just uh, you know here by chance, please subscribe. It really helps me, and if you uh, if you need anything, um, I I have links in my in the description to my Facebook groups and my Facebook uh, page, and yeah, I'll see you in the next videos. Bye bye. <laughs>